Hey guys, welcome back, and if you're here for your first time, I appreciate it. I apologize about the background noise, like in most of my other videos, I state that I live in Arizona, and it is summer right now, and yesterday it got up to like 115, and I'm, you know, a, a chubby little short dude, and I feel like my skin's gonna melt off of my bones, so I need all the AC units I could possibly have on. Anyways, let's get straight to the gun so I don't get yelled at again. Um... It's obviously, as you can tell by the title, a Caltech P17. Let's open her up. And again, this is not a review video at all. Uh, this is just going to be kind of a show and point out the features. You need to make your decision. Let's take a look at it. First glances, it looks like a water gun. Let's set you guys back down. Hey guys check this out I got two hands two hands I got a new tripod finally for my phone um, if my dog chews this one up I'm going to be so mad he got my blueberry muffin this morning and he's a smart dog he doesn't chew when we're gone but if I set something down for a second and go you know go to use the bathroom or to change the laundry and I come out it's gone he'll tear it up and I'm gonna start putting a muzzle on him until he learns um, anyways, why did I buy the P17 Caltech? Uh, one, the price. Uh, MSRP is what, $199, so just say $200. Um, and you could go into a gun store if they have it in stock and probably walk out at $174. Uh, that's what I did. I did $174 out the door. Um, anyways, uh, let's check out the features. So, on the trigger guard there is your mag release so it's a, uh, a trigger guard mag release the cool thing with that is it's ambi you can do it either side just like the thumb safety either side so that's a, those are two cool features it's uh, pretty much ambi you got your mag drop your safety it is unloaded mag drop and safety the only thing is your uh, slide drop is on one side it's right there so it is, it is a little scary because that is your drop right there and you feel like your thumb's going to get up in there, but I'm guessing they gave that thought and the way they cut it out, it really does miss your thumb. Um, it does have fiber optic front sight, has adjustable rear sight, has a rail for your accessory. That's how you drop down the slide or whatnot, kind of like a Glock or disassemble it. I'm not going to really do that right now. Um, let's check this out real quick. Uh, where is it? There we go. The threaded barrel or whatnot. So it comes with a little tiny baby barrel wrench. It's so cute and a thread adapter. Um, so let's check out what it comes with real quick. It oh, it's super easy to rack back too. Um, that that's another reason why I bought it was because it's it's a very light gun, 14 ounces fully loaded. It's ambi. It's a perfect gun to teach your kids or somebody that's fearful or recoil, this would be the perfect gun. It's it's extremely lightweight. Yes, it feels kind of squirt gunish, but it's it, it the gun will grow on you, my opinion. It grew on me. Let's see what Caltech puts in their box. What the hell is this? The mini magnum? Huh. Thanks, Caltech. No, I'm just kidding. I put that in there for funds. So this was my other 22 I had. So I had this guy, and trying to teach my son on this one, you have to, you know, pull back the hammer each time you shoot it. Um, I'd rather do it on that guy over there, the Caltech. And it's unloaded, don't worry. So it comes with two extra mags, so for a total of three mags, they are plastic. They feel extremely cheap, like if you drop them, they'd break. But I dropped one earlier, and it didn't break, so it's kind of durable. And I have a tile floor. Um, of course, your NRA sign-up thing. Here's the cute little barrel freaking uh, wrench. We got that little guy. It is adorable, and there's your adapter and your Allen key. Um, this gun would be pretty sweet to uh, suppress. I might look into doing that, but I do have an XDM Elite coming um, that is threaded, so I don't know. Maybe I just do that. <laughs> it comes with a uh, uh, trigger lock. 
this right here. I'm going to praise Caltech and tell them that they're amazing for doing this. And I was so stoked when I opened the box and seen not one. Let's take a look. Not one. Not two. But three stickers. Three freaking decals. I love stickers. Caltech gives three stickers with their guns. That's pretty freaking sweet. Um, Ruger only gave me one sticker. I think uh, Springfield only gave me one sticker. I don't think Glock gave me any sticker. Um, but Caltech, Caltech gives three stickers. Anyways, let's get back to the gun. That's all it really comes with. Uh, I do have my receipt, but you guys don't need to see that. I mean, I could show you the total if you don't believe me, but... Yes, I paid 174 out the door. All right, let's take a last look at her before we go. Let's get it in the sun. There we go. Oh, one thing that I didn't show you guys. I know I feel real dumb. There is a indicator. So if you look right here, it's red. And then when you shoot, it disappears. So that's another feature. There's indicator, adjustable rear sight, fiber optic front sight, threaded barrel, rail, uh, mag release tri on the trigger guard, ambi safety. I mean, it's pretty sweet. And it, it's pretty skinny, too. It do The lower part does come apart in two pieces. It's kind of silly. It reminds me of an old squirt gun. But... Yeah, there she is. Hopefully this helped somebody make their mind up. If they just want a cheap little fun gun, that's the guy right there. And if uh, if you guys want to spend more money, then of course there's other 22s out there. Um, like the Welter, uh, the Zigzauer Mosquito, if you could still find them. Um, the GSG-5s. There's, there's other 22s out there, don't get me wrong. Um, but probably not with this many features uh hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did leave a thumbs up if you didn't um thank you for tuning in anyways i appreciate it if you guys have any questions feel free to leave a comment i will reply back as quick as i possibly can uh thank you guys again hope you guys come back later